Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Helcas, and welcome back to Sierra Seven. In today's video, we continue on the story of Sierra Seven. On the previous episode, we completed training, safe house, storage, apartment, and parkade, and now we're on warehouse. And also, I've been playing for a while. Check out the uh, new military drip. And also, I'm gonna buy a new gun, and that's the Magnum because I've been using my pistol more than I use my primary. So I'm gonna buy the Magnum instead because I love revolvers. Revolvers are such a beautiful gun. Okay, so right now we're at our sixth mission, the warehouse, Sente Fe USA. Intel has come in the warehouse. Our drone has been watching are confirmed to contain shipment from a known small arms supplier for the militia. We're sending you in for a sweep and clear any threat within the warehouse. Ensure the safety of our investigation unit. That's it, Mike. He's dead. Oh. Those Sierra guys. We lost storage unit and now asset Mike. Where the hell are we going to get our weapons? Think Badger. What opportunity hides in these obstacles? We can get guns in from Mexico from junior people? I don't know, man. Media core. Without acid Mike, his warehouse now sits unprotected. His warehouse full of a firearm with no one watching over them. No guards? Oh man, boss, we can get those guns for us. I'm calling the boys now. Excellent work neutralizing acid Mike. Now the acid Mike is out of the picture. Every low life within 200 miles will be going after his merchandise. His warehouse will be swarming with potential targets. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I have to clear this with the high ops. Forget the bureaucracy. Let's neutralize every one of those thugs trying to get weapons from Acid Mike's warehouse. Brass will notice this kind of inactivity gets people promotions. Or fired. How about I go take a stroll through the warehouse? If anybody shoots at me, It'll be their own fault. I don't know about this. Seven? Zero seven? Report in! Ouch, you piece of shit. Oh god. That was terrible. I'm a quick job, don't mess with me. I was gonna get all headshots. Oh god. This gun's an instant kill, which I like it. Oh, it pierced armor as well, I like that. Damn it. Come out. Thank you. Oh my god, I almost shot him. Don't open the door. Your ballistic shield is useless when you don't crouch. Come out! Oh shit. Really? Shit. Come out! Really? Quick draw. Clear. Nice job, Sierra. 
LT. Seven, I demand to know what the hell is going on. We didn't need any intel on this one. Militia were crawling all over as Mike's warehouse. And some civilians as well, I suppose. Were? They're not crawling anymore or moving at all already. Damn it, Seven. I did not order you to hit the warehouse. I know, boss. But we're talking about more dead militia. I believe you'll thank me eventually. It does not work this way, Seven. I will be in Hellstorm with Brass of the Disc. I'm sorry to put you in trouble. But don't forget our main objective is to neutralize the militia. Seven out. Urban and Senada. I think I pronounced that right. Mexico. Our intel is located a high variable target that goes by Badger. Your task will be to capture Badger alive and pass him to our investigation team. Boss, there's a problem. What is it? I don't know how, but militia be us to the warehouse. Where are you now? I'm on hill looking over the scene. Bro, you won't believe it. Sierra got here and destroyed the militia. The Sierra people are taking all the weapons out of the warehouse now. And all the dead bodies. What do you want me to do? Return home, Badger. Shall I hit up Junior? There's more guns in Mexico. Return home. Okay. Yo, Junior. I thought your boss told you to return home. What up, amigo? You're hearing what's happening up here. I see Mike is dead and we got no guns. Well, damn. You know who has guns? Me, boy. Echo won't let me get them off you, bro. Echo. <laughs> your boss won't even tell you his name, man. So, why should you listen to him, huh? Come down here and we can talk, easy. Mr. Black, I have a favor to ask of you. We have an imposter among us. Echo. What makes you think you're in a position for a favor from me? Because this will benefit the both of us. One of my subordinates has disobeyed my orders. He's heading to a gun supply in Mexico. It's not my fault that you can't control your children. If he succeeds in a deal, he will have weapon in the hands of more militia. So you want us to kill your own people for you? I do not deal with the Mexicans. You promise not to kill my man Badger, and I will give you the location. Alright, Echo. I'm interested. Bonus Diaz LT. Are you in position 7? Roger that, overlooking Junior's weapon shipments. Do you have eyes on our target? Negative, Badger must be inside. Echo believe we will do his dirty work for him. But I have a better idea. Capture Badger, we will find use for him. But do not kill Badger. He won't go without a fight. Find a way to bring him down alive. Shoot him in the leg. Roger that. I'll clear Junior's man from the outside. Then I'll sneak in and grab Badger. Good luck, Seven. It never easy works out of the border. Sniper mission, huh? What? Shit. Okay, now I got that right. No one's looking at this guy, so I think I should. It should be fine for me to shoot him. Right? Nice. Got that right. Checkpoint. Nice. Oh, thank God. And then this guy. And then this guy. Complete. Oh shit. He got a hostage. That fail or win? Oh, damn. The enemy is on to us. Such clean shooting gone to waste by random chance. No time for that, Seven. They were warm, Badger. We are here. I'm setting the van. Be ready to move in. 
Roger, weapons free. Why not send an extra crew with me? Why just a van? Remember, we need Badger alive. Find a way to take him alive. Oh, that's him. I thought he don't have a mask on. Him and Junior's men know you're coming. Are you alright, Seven? It's very hot in this van. Haha, <laughs> Raj Dad, happy hunting. Yeah, I'm using my Uzi this time. I'm gonna save my revolver for, for when I run out of ammo. Ah! Shit! Ooh, that double kill! Shit! Ah, shit! God damn it, let me remote! Let me reload my gun. Let me reload, god damn it. Nice! Okay, now I finally reload my gun. Oh! I thought I hit him. You b Oh, shit! Nope! Gonna stab you. Get London. Reload. Shit. Let me reload real quick. Get down at that son of a b again. No, 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 no. I'm trying to keep you alive. Stop. Stop. Oh shit! Area clear. Nice job, Sierra. <laughs> and you just stand there? Don't look painful on the drone footage. Yeah, no shit, I snapped his whole wrist. You should hear him crying. Brass is still on my case. But capture one of Echo's men is like a Christmas present. I'm sure our little friend Badger will help us get to Echo. He will if he wants to keep his other wrist. That shit is twitching. Nice work, Seven. I'll see you back on home soil. Roger that. Out. Hotel. Tangeries, Morocco. We we'll track a bomb maker plan to attack Hotel Tangier. He must know we are after him and has armed militia guards. We cannot let the bomb maker attack the hotel. Take him out along with his security. LT, please. What's wrong, Badger? Can't sleep? Don't like the food? Sorry, Badger. Just leave a Yelp review and we will get back to you. Yeah, leave a review. How is this legal? Because you're a criminal? You son of a bitch. Let me out. My wrist. I need a hospital. I'm not a dog. There's no chain on your neck, though. Unless this gold one. You've been loyal like a dog. You don't want to tell us anything about your master. I told you LT, I ne have never met Echo, how can I tell you anything about him? Fine dog, if you don't want to give up your master, you better tell me something else that is worth your life. Junior, help me bro. Badger, what the hell happened? I came back to my house full of cars and bullet holes. It was the Syrah team. Putos, how did you escape? I barely made it out. 
we are heading to America. We are bringing a little present for the SEER team. Tell me the plan. Are you sure you are safe? Can I trust you this time? Yeah. Alright, check this out. My people found a hotel full of politicians. No more threats, no more talking. It's time we test our bomb maker for real. I want to help you. Tell me everything. Alright, let's see. This is what we're going to do. Badger proved useful. Do we have Echo? I believe Badger can get us to Echo. So what do we have? Junior, our amigo from Mexico is having a bomb make strike on American soil. The Tangier Hotel on West 90. He believes Badger is able to help. We are getting all the details straight from Badger himself. If we stop the hotel bombing, Junior will know we have Badger. We cannot let a bomb go off in the middle of the city. We're sending you in. Only me cannot send a team with me as well. Stop the bomb maker before it arms any explosive. Roger, I'm on the way. Damn it! Come out! Hands in the air! Hands in the air, not guns in the air. Oh! Oh my god, I was so scared. Drop the shield! Shit! How could a bicycle be a helmet? How could a bike helmet be bulletproof? What? Where you come from? Oh, that's a wall over there. Oh, what the hell? I'm facing a juggernaut. A juggernaut with a pistol. Damn it! Get out of my face! What? Yeah, put that middle finger in my face again. I'll shove that up your ass. Got it! Helmet's out! Nope! What? That miss? Got him! How could you how could you have a bomb suit and die? That shit is embarrassing. Damn. The bomb maker arm explosive. Send a team here, LT. There's no time. You're going to have to disarm it yourself. Oh well, guess everybody's gonna die. No. No way. Seven, listen to me. You have to do this. Intel is informing me about this type of bomb now. To disarm it, you have to do the following. Follow the wires from the left and right knots. Can I just grab the bomb and throw it out the window? Make sure the color of each knot matches the one it's connected. Once the left and right knots match each other, you should be able to disarm the bomb. Follow the wires, match the colors. Got it. 7. There are civilians within the blast radius, so we need throw it out of the window. Is that easy? I have things to do, LT. Follow the wire, match the color. Okay. Oh my god, what the hell is this?
Oh my god. Uh, you know, I'm gonna gamble this shit. I'm gonna gamble it. Oh god. I'm gonna assume this. I'm gonna assume this. Oh shit. Oh, everybody's dead. Shit. Okay. Oh, okay. Nice. Area clear. Nice. Oh, I gambled it. Seven. Are you alright? LT. You owe me a beer. Christ. I hate to say it. Next time, let me know there's a live bomb take it away before I check into a hotel. You never cease to amaze the seven. We were checking your vitals during the bomb diffuser. I don't think anyone has ever survived a heart rate that fast. The fact that you remain calm enough to defuse that bomb. Uh, no. It's not this short of a damn miracle. That was pretty exciting. Yeah, return to base 7. Embassy, Winhoik, South Africa. We have just received videotape of militia members holding a high-ranking US officials hostage at the ER. We are running out of time and their demands embassy. You will be sent in to rescue all hostage and eliminate the militia members. You are dead man badger. Junior, please man. I didn't know what to do. I'm scared man. American law don't allow for anything serious to happen to you in their prisons. They broke you, badger. You talk, and now my men are dead because of you. There's nothing else I can do, bro. Your day is coming. Bang. Echo, please boss, I need help. I'm sorry, Badger. You made your decision. I'm trying to help you, boss. I thought I could get your guts for the militia. There's a reason I do not deal with Junior. He is a vicious animal with no control. Unfortunately for you, Badger, you will soon find that out. I would do anything, boss. Just say the word. Alright, Badger. If you're willing to prove your loyalty to me, there is something. Anything, boss. Tell me. Embassy tomorrow. Badger and the remaining crew will hit it hard and fast. You are ordering Badgers to kill innocent who will not help you gain our trust. So why order him to hit the embassy? Badger's order are not to harm any civilian, but they will fire upon your team. I trust your unit will initialize Badger and his men. You're giving your own to try and gain my trust. I know a losing battle when I see one. I will need your help against Junior. Approaching LZ. Trevor, declare the embassy. This is Badger's last stand. Prepare for hostile engagement. Check your fire, there will be civilians. Roger that. Guess I'll be using the revolver. Damn it! Shit! Damn it! Oh, double kill! I'm just keep using my revolver because that's gonna be hostage, and I and I don't want the spread of my Mac 11 to kill them. Shite. Come out!
that quick draw though. Shit. Damn it. I was trying to flick that shot, but I missed. Oh, no. Oh. Area clear. That was I so close. Sierra. Area clear. Hostage are secure and Badger is dead. Copy that. Nice work. Why exactly was Badger trying to gain here? He had no choice. Both Echo and Junior disowned him. Echo betrayed him and sent him and his men to die here. I still think working with Echo is a good idea. Clearly Echo cannot be trusted. Trusted? No. But there is use for him. I don't like it. I hope you know what you're doing. So do I. Okay, so I'm going to leave to this episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. We have completed Warehouse, Urban, Hotel, and Embassy. And we have brought a new gun, the Magnum. We killed a uh, boss. We broke Badger's wrist and killed him. And also killed a guy in a bomb suit and defused a very hard bomb. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Share with a friend on social media. I have a Discord server link in the description. Go check it out. With that being said, I'll see you all next time. Hellcats signing out.